All right, hello guys. This is your final forecast for Winter Storm Harper. We're going to get right into it. Before I get started with this video, though, I would like to mention that you should make sure to send in videos or pictures of this storm happening to my Twitter, at Prime Patriots. That way, I will be featuring them in a video, hopefully after the storm. It's going to be like videos from Harper or something. I'm going to try to compile a bunch of videos and pictures from the storm, especially ones that are sent in from you guys. Uh, that way, we can kind of always look back at some of the videos and everything from the storm. So I'd like to compile that and make a video for that. So if you're interested in sending in videos, if you're in the affected areas, uh, make sure to tweet them at me and let me know where you're from so I can put that in the video, obviously. That's what I would like to do at least, so hopefully that all goes as planned. Anyway, let's get right into the snowfall forecast. A lot has changed and things have trended north and warmer, so I'm sorry to disappoint a lot of you there closer to the coast uh, in southern New England, New York City. Uh, lots of areas a little bit disappointing here as we've moved north and warmer, so a lot more rain mixing in there, unfortunately. So, I wanted to start off by mentioning, again, New York City, Long Island, uh, Connecticut, Rhode Island, southern Massachusetts, you all have downgraded in snow amounts, as well as southeastern Pennsylvania a lot as well. So, if you're in that white section, you're at anywhere from a dusting to three inches of snow the light shade of blue you're at three inches to six inches of snow the medium shade of blue you're at six to ten inches of snow and that darkest shade of blue you're at 10 to 15 inches of snow in the purple section you're at 15 to 20 inches of snow and in the pink section you're looking at 20 to 30 inches of snow likely on the lower end of that but I expect some 24 inch amounts in some of those pink areas uh, that area has moved north as well so upstate New York you're looking at a good chance of that Green Mountains, White Mountains, and then some portions of northern eastern, northeastern Maine, uh, in inland Maine. That was originally supposed to be near the coast, but we've kind of been creeping that north and further north and further north, and now it's finally approaching kind of like that Canadian border actually now. So, uh, yeah, things have been trending north. This looks to be the final forecast. If I do happen to update this forecast at all, I will be putting it most likely not in a video. I'll I'll post it in a post on my YouTube and most likely Twitter if I do have to update this. But this looks like a really good forecast at this point and we're already starting to see snow. So there's no point in updating it. This is the final forecast most likely. Anyway, stay safe guys and look forward to the next video. Make sure to subscribe for the latest updates on Winter Storm Harper and future winter storms for New England in the Northeastern United States. See you guys later.